Yo, what's going on guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Of course, today we are back on the number one custom saver, which of course is Lunite, holding 500 plus daily and 600 plus at peak times. And if you guys are coming for the first time, make sure and use this command right here, colon colon affair, and simply type protect you for a very juicy starter pack, as you see on the screen. Also, let the know you're coming for me guys, so please do so. Anyways, without further ado, last video's giveaway winner is going down below, and the new giveaway for today will be down below as well, so make sure and check that out. Anyways, I do hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let's hop into it. Alrighty guys, so welcome to my first ever loot from video on the Bass Custom Saver, which of course is Loot Knight. Now there's been so many bosses being released here recently on the savers, so yeah, I figured it's the best time to start a loot from. On top of that, a brand new boss being Zalana, which will also be something I'll be showing off very soon, so stay tuned. Anyways, as you can see here, the Magester drops literally Celestial Scrolls. We can get the new Tanzanite Casket, Magester Shard, and the Dragon Bone Upgrade Kit. Also, loads for the comments that definitely add up. And I'm telling you guys now the drop tables for these bosses is definitely OP. The Dragon Boat Upgrade Kits are going for 250 mil. Early no Tanzanite Caskets being sold, but they go for about 100 mil a pop. Then of course the shards here, the Tecton being the most valuable because they're really in high demand, going for about 400 to 500 mil a pop. But you can see the Skatiza ones here are going for about 200. The Magester as well, about 200 to 250. So of course today's video will definitely be a crazy little loot from. We will also be wearing like Bass and Slide gear. We got the Celestial Aura, Destiny Use Set, we got the Tecton Amulet, Skatiza Ring, Magester Gloves, Cloak of the Kings, Dragon Bone Quiver, and we have literally 2,070 drop rate. And of course, we got the Leviathan Pet, which will definitely help out. Now, in order to unlock the Magester, Tecton, or the Skatizo, we will need to unlock the Assassin's Guild and then become an Assassin's Master to unlock these three bosses, so it's definitely a grind. But you guys can see the mechanics here as well, if you just take a quick glance. So it is a boss we can do with the group, so you can see we got the Magester, Tecton Portal, and a Skatizo. Starting off today with the beautiful Magester. So yeah, you need to be an Assassin's Master, as you can see, I just gave myself tier 4, since of course we're on beta. We also need all three combat styles, so that's something I need to go ahead and get out of the bank. Anyways, we are doing loot from one hour at the OG Magester, so I hope you guys enjoy. Now as you guys can see, there are minions here, so the kills do take quite some time. It's obviously not AFK, so I will be moving around quite a bit throughout this hour. Just hoping to get a rare drop, so wish me luck. Alright, so we're coming up on kill 17 right now, which is about, what, say, 10-15 minutes deep. Let's see what we receive. We already got 3.6 mil cash, 1.3 million PVM tickets. Also some stuff from my dailies, but yo, that's pretty OP. Obviously the drops here are crazy. A 1 in 7500 for the Tanzanite Casket, Magester Shard, 1 in 20k, Dragon Bone Upgrade Kit, 1 in 20k, so it's gonna be OP, but obviously the comments do add up, so today's gonna be a good video. I feel we will get lucky. At least I hope we get lucky. We'll see, I guess. I see 50% Celestial Scroll, 30 minutes times 3 to my bank, boys. What's the drop rate for that? A 1 in 2500, bro. Come on. That's actually quite F. I mean, it's not terrible if I was actually using the Celestial Zone. But, I mean, for the loot from, I was hoping for something better. Come on, guys. Alright, so this kill right here equals 45kc. 2 OP chest, not bad. Alright, so let's check the bank in 45 kills. 75 25k upgrade token packs. We got 75 OP chest. And then we got 30 at 50% celestial scrolls. 30 grand mystery boxes. The money case. An angelic case. And of course the inventory. About 10 mil. 14 mil PVM tickets. And we're about 40 minutes down. So about another 20 minutes remaining right here. Hopefully we get lucky in the next 20 minutes. I really want to see a shard or a dragon bone upgrade kit. This kill right here will make the 50th kill on the Magester. 11 million upgrade tokens. Almost 5 million PVM tickets. And of course all this. I definitely gotta say these bosses are 100% worth camping and are definitely good money. Obviously, I have a chance of receiving some crazy rares as well. That would just make the money freaking skyrocket. So if you're asking my opinion on if it's good to camp or not, 100% dude. The Magester seems very OP. Also quite chill. I do have the OP command on, but eh. Either way, you're still making good money. And you can literally do it in a bossing party, which makes it even better. Oh, well, we got two minutes left, so about two, three more kills. Let's do it. We're at 57 kills right now, so I'll do 30 more to get a clear 60. Now, obviously, I got the OP command, so you guys won't be getting 60 kills in an hour. But with a party, you just may. And this gives you a clean idea of what you're going to receive in 60 kills without a rare drop. Besides the Celestial Scrolls, still super crazy money. So, one hour, 60 kills, and that is the loot, boys. Not terrible, to be fair. Obviously, none of the super good rare drops. 
but I'll still take it. I mean, that's decent money. And of course, again, we had a chance at receiving some crazy rares. But hey, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video just showing you the loots from these new bosses. I'll be doing a loot from every boss, so kind of, you know, leave some comments down below if you want to see one sooner. So yeah, guys, I hope you all enjoyed today's video. I'll be back very soon with another one, and peace.